Okay, so I wanted to talk a little bit about classroom management in the art room because there's some unique things and one of them is glue. So what I have done is I have bought what are bingo daubers and I have filled them with glue and they have a spongy bit on top. So instead of having the full glue bottle, the students just have to dab and then put their two pieces of paper together. Another way um, for the glue disbursement is per table. Um, I have just a little Ziploc here and it has glue and it has a sponge and the sponge has absorbed the glue that is around it. So again, the students just have to dab their piece of paper onto the sponge. They just get the right amount of glue on there and then they just stick it to their next piece. So this is a lifesaver. So my last right? classroom management tips involves playing cards. And I chose these because they're a little too big to shuffle naturally. So I use them in my classroom. And I give each student one of the cards and I place it face up, so flamingo side up, at their table. And if they're having any problems or they need me to come by, they just flip over their card. And as a teacher, as I'm walking around the classroom, I can see the cards and I can just go to those students. I actually learned this trick from my yoga teacher who gives us all a playing card and if you don't want to be touched you keep it uh, with the flamingo side up and then if you want her to come by and adjust you, you flip it the other way. And I thought this was a great idea to use for your class um, so that way there's not people wandering around or a lot of noise like teacher, teacher come help me. I can just quickly glance at who is good, who's working um, and then who needs a little more help.